What's up? How are you guys this week? Another Monday down at Frankie's Free Range Meat. And if you guys are in the New York area, Northeast Massachusetts, I think everywhere got blasted with a pretty bad snowstorm, maybe a foot of snow by us. And thankfully it was on the weekend, so it didn't really affect business. I remember last year, like two weeks in a row, we actually couldn't ship because all of New York, the whole area was basically out of commission for like two weeks in a row because the storm landed perfectly on like a Sunday night every single time. And I am dressed a little light for a winter storm, but I have to showcase our new Wi-Fi shielding clothing, which is finally in today. We have the full long sleeve sweatshirt, long sleeve pants, joggers, whatever you like to call them. And it's not like a super heavy sweatshirt, but it's definitely not a lighter material. And we're also gonna have uh, some wool hats in stock, hopefully this week, just like a regular uh, acrylic beanie hat that's gonna have some Wi-Fi shielding material inside. Both should be listed on the website by the time you guys see this video. Uh, so we'll talk more about the Wi-Fi shielding clothing towards the end when we go downstairs. We do have a few new products in this week. We have some Fontina cheese, very limited amount. Might be out of it, we'll check. I made some more roast beef for you guys. I'm not sure if that's gonna be a consistent thing. And we do have a very nice high quality chicken stock. So let's go take a look at those real quick. We have some chocolate best bars back in stock, hopefully. Uh, we did have an issue with the whey protein coming in. Uh, you know, these importers are always pricks. You know, they tell me it's gonna be this price door-to-door -door shipping, and then they email me like three weeks later, oh, you have to contact your customs broker and get it through Clint. So I don't, I don't know when the whey protein's coming. I don't know if that's gonna be another big issue, but you know, it's just nonsense on top of nonsense on top of nonsense. So we still have a decent amount of Fontina cheese in stock, guys. It's a cow's milk cheese. I know a lot of like Italian recipes use it. They put it on pizza a lot. So if you guys wanna try this out, we do have about 15 in stock. I've been making roast beef like a lunatic for you guys. It's really, really amazing, delicious, cooked rare. I've been eating it all week. I honestly don't know if I'm gonna have the sanity to keep making this stuff, but you guys have been buying it out, really enjoying it again. Let me know if you guys purchase it, how you like it, but for me, very, very delicious. For one, something that wasn't my idea. Uh, we have a lot of like chicken carcasses from making the, the breast, the thighs, you know, just breaking them down. And we decided to do a chicken stock, so this is those chicken carcasses with carrot, onion, celery, no salt added. So if you guys want a completely organic chicken stock, soup, broth, whatever, it's going to be on frankiesrangefoods.com. I might lower the price a little bit more, but you know, no one's really selling this stuff. Even all like the Amish farms, they, they put it in plastic, they're not using organic ingredients, they cut corners, they're not using glass bottled mineral water. So I'm pretty happy about the quality of the products we have and that we're continuing to offer you guys. And you know, it's kind of what keeps me going. Uh, at least, you know, I think I mentioned last week, we'll see if we can get any money from that uh, Biden infrastructure bill and maybe build something. But for me, just to have, you know, the money to purchase a facility, relocate, all that stuff, it's just, I'm just not willing to just last that long if I had to save up the money myself. So we have plenty of orders going out for all of those non-meat businesses, Frankie's Free Range Foods, Frankie's Naturals, Organ Supplements, Wi-Fi Shielding. The guys have been packing meat orders and, and it's been picking up a little bit these past few weeks. So I'm happy about that. Hopefully we can keep all of the meat, all of the products in stock and, and continue that trend. So I won't disappear to Colombia as quickly as I thought. And guys, honestly, if I was bilingual, if I could speak multiple languages, I, I, would, I would not be here anymore. I would probably be, you know, with, with uh, speak, speak in ching, I can't say that. Uh, you know, I've joked about basically every ethnicity, Russian girls, Mexican girls, Colombian girls, but, but in all honesty, it's always the Asian girls, you know, whether they're Chinese, Japanese, Korean, and that's where I lean towards. Unfortunately, their languages are in hieroglyphics and that's a far shot. At least the Spanish girls, you know, the, the language is in English and I kind of have some idea of the words, but let's hop in the freezer. I don't think anything new is in stock. We're trying to get some pork fat and some different cuts of pork back in next week for you guys. We showed you guys last week the free promotion is uh, the one pound grass-fed beef belly. And I think we're gonna continue doing that through this week, but that's gonna be it. Then I think we'll either hop back to the bison or something else. Let's get out of here. As much as I enjoy giving you guys, you know, free stuff to try out every week, it's difficult because not only are my prices lower than 
any other online meat business, especially considering the 100% grass-fed quality. We also don't charge shipping. I mean, California orders were basically breaking even. That was under the hopes that we would get a West Coast warehouse. And the assumption of Frankie's Range Meat in general was, you know, try to be competitive with all of these other businesses by using a lower price point, And hopefully, eventually, we could either relocate or get a bank loan or, or reduce cost of goods. And, and none of that's happened yet. And it's been three years now. So we'll see. We'll see where we can uh, get you guys next week. And, and that's why I'm doing all this ridiculous stuff. Like, like no other business, for the most part, is going to have new products like that every week. I'm not going to name other companies that, that use like ridiculous deceptive practices. But since I'm able to be creative and do things on my own and have these new products every week, you know, it keeps customers coming back when I'm not able to offer all of the cuts I like or have access to everything I want. You know, some companies are literally like feeding pigs corn and soy and saying it's Iberico when it's just the breed of the pig while we're importing Spanish Iberico not nearly selling as much. You have some companies using even more deceptive marketing saying that they have high quality chicken, pork, whatever it is, but it's the same conventional stuff in the supermarket. So yeah, it's unfortunate when your business competitors technically aren't competitors because they're just a bunch of fucking liars. But I mean, they're all liars, to be honest. No one has integrity. And you know, all these businesses are run by people that don't really actually care about the quality of the product. They were just in the business, had family in it, unlike me, who started the actual business because I wanted quality product. But enough complaining for today. Organ supplements, we don't have anything. I keep telling you guys I'm gonna make that magnesium oil. Maybe it'll be this week. Frankie's Naturals, we're gonna have a new lip balm formula available within the week. Instead of the beef tallow, I'm using coconut oil. It's just melts much easier, feels much better. And you know, sometimes the beef tallow is a very grassy taste. So I, I think you guys are gonna like that more for the texture and the application. Wi-Fi shielding, here's all the new winter clothing we got in for you guys. It's all black, top and bottom. We have mostly large and medium available, a few small, a few extra large, and then I can get some more made if you guys really want it. So uh, you guys know the, like the tank top and the underwear is about $60 and $30. This is $155 for the top and $145 for the bottom. The fabric is very expensive. It's more than double the fabric and my tailor charges me about $40 per piece. Like she charges me $40 to make the shirt, $40 to make the pants. That's the cost of American labor guys. So my profit margin isn't that great, but you know, I'm supporting a couple of different businesses and I'm able to have a product that I can use myself. If you look online, still the cheapest. You look Wi-Fi shielding sweatshirt, Wi-Fi shielding sweatpants, they're all around 170, 180, over $200. So uh, let me know what you guys think. I don't think we sold too many yet, but personally, I've been feeling a lot better wearing the, the full covering because although it is important to you know, protect the digestive organs and reproductive system and your brain, uh, just with like a tank top and underwear, when you can actually reduce the cellular oxidative stress of like all of your arms, all of the leg, it's just so much more tissue you're protecting. Uh, and is that the reason I've been feeling significantly better over the past few weeks? I don't know. It could be. Uh, you still want to make sure to like wear a head net, sleep in a bed canopy, protect your head, turn your phone off, keep it on airplane mode as much as possible. I think that's kind of it for down here. So nothing really crazy this week, guys. Just wanted to give you an inventory update on all that stuff. And I forgot to mention earlier, we also have some lamb fat back in stock, a couple of things you guys are missing. So thank you guys for joining me today. You can see all of these businesses on frank-stefano.com, including Frankie's Free Range Meat. If you could please drop a like on the video, subscribe so that YouTube can unsubscribe you next week, and be sure to check that notification bell so they don't notify you of my videos. Thanks again for joining me, guys. As I said, frank-stefano.com. I'll see you for tomorrow.